All right, so now let's make this uh, look just a little bit better. So as is noticed, we don't have anything. We don't have like a label for the button. And uh, what I would think we should probably just use uh, take advantage of Font Awesome and put in like a like a carrot or a chevron down. Let's go ahead and go to Font Awesome's website. And if we come over here to icons, click on that. Looks like they actually added some new icons recently. Um, I don't want to get distracted by that. So we're going to look around here. I already know that I'm looking for a chevron, so I'm going to do a control F. There we go. So we want chevron dash down. So really, I'm just going to go ahead and copy this. And we'll come in here and in between the button tags here, I'm just going to go ahead and hit enter actually and do a paste. Save that. Hop back over to our page and refresh. There we go. It looks a little better. Um, let's shove it over to the right. So in here with the uh, class, after button dash default, we'll do poll dash right save that refresh and that's a little better it's not being cleared though so it looks kind of funny you know what i've actually got a different idea let's go ahead and i want to do this similar to the way their example was so instead of using the button i want to use an a tag which we really don't have to change much but i'm going to wrap this around i'm going to wrap this around the label so up here on line 16, let's hit enter after the label a couple of times here. Let's move this opening button tag up here above the label. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to change the button to A. We can get rid of the type property. And let's get rid of the poll right in the class. Um, the chevron might actually still look good, so let's bump this up to the line where the label is and just hit uh, space to give it a little, well, space. Let's try this out. Let's save that. Refresh. Oh, that's almost what I wanted. We don't need, uh, we want to take this whole button class out in general. So remove that and save. Come back, refresh. There you go. I want to keep it like that. Now I also want to show you, you see how we have, even if we have these opened, we can still move them around, resort them and everything. So that's pretty cool. Now we need to actually put the form inside there.